In this video, I'll talk about how to improve your dog's gut health, the symptoms of an unhealthy gut, and five important ways to improve your dog's gut health. Hi, I'm Dan Scott, Canine Nutrition and Home Remedy Specialist, and if you're new here, hit the subscribe button below to stay in touch with all the latest videos that I do, and feel free to comment or ask questions below. You probably know about the importance of your dog's gut health to prevent dog gut health problems such as food allergies and IBD or irritable bowel disease. However, what many pet parents don't realize is that an unhealthy gut causes inflammation throughout the body. So instead of thinking that your Labrador's middle-aged arthritis symptoms are normal and just how it goes, more likely your dog is suffering a digestive complaint such as dysbiosis or leaky gut syndrome. Leaky gut leads to many health issues, including the early onset of arthritis. Leaky gut will also lead to the symptoms of food allergies, autoimmune disease, liver dysfunction, EPI or exocrine pancreatic insufficiency, diabetes, weight gain, low energy and a slow metabolism. Remember, when your dog's gut isn't healthy, your dog isn't healthy. Leaky gut syndrome stops the food your dog eats from being fully digested and absorbed properly. Leaky gut starts when your dog's mucosal semi-permeable intestinal lining becomes inflamed and damaged. The microscopic cells that line the small intestine, called villus, atrophy and become damaged through the inflammation, leaving holes in the lining. Now, generally the gut lining allows fully digested nutrients from the intestines to pass through it and into the bloodstream, but keeping toxins, undigested food and everything else inside the gut. However, as tiny gaps open up, making the lining more permeable, it can no longer effectively filter out toxins, allowing them and undigested food particles to get into your dog's bloodstream, leading to leaky gut syndrome. And with this in mind, here's five ways to begin healing your dog's gut health. Step one is to feed your dog a quality powdered probiotic to build up healthy colonies of beneficial bacteria in the gut. This quickly brings down bad gas, diarrhea, bloat, and other digestive issues. There's no prep, no fuss, you simply add a small amount of your dog's, to your dog's meals and watch what happens over the following weeks. And I'll leave a link in the description below and a link above to the best probiotic product I know of. And step two is to give your dog prebiotics to feed the probiotics already in the gut and help the gut bacteria produce fatty acids that protect the mucosal cells in the intestinal lining. The probiotic I discussed in step one also contains prebiotics. Step three is to stop pharmaceutical drugs and medications and use the natural effective alternatives. And I'll leave a link to a good book on home remedies for dogs that covers exactly what you need for flea and tick control, deworming, natural antibiotics and reducing over vaccination. Step four is to give your dog digestive enzymes to help break down the food your dog eats so the nutrients in the food can be more easily absorbed. Kibble fed dogs always need extra enzymes because commercial pet food has zero enzymes in it and a dog's natural supply is limited causing stress to the digestive system. This also means your dog becomes undersupplied and susceptible to disease and breakdown. Glands as well as major organs become stressed from enzyme deficiency and this becomes more visible as your dog ages and loses fatality. If a dog has spent most of its own enzymes and isn't getting any in the diet and kibble fed dogs get none, their cellular function and health will rapidly decline. And I'll leave a link to an excellent digestive enzyme in the description below and at the link above. And step five is to feed your dog a healthier diet. Diet plays a huge role in your dog's gut health and is the underlying cause of nine out of 10 health problems in dogs for an unbalanced immune system. Diet is the main underlying cause of leaky gut in dogs. Kibble is full of starch, which leads to inflammation in the gut and other directly related health problems, such as arthritis, allergy-related allergy skin and coat problems, digestive complaint, hot spots, diarrhea issues, yeast infections, ear infections, and renal problems. And it's diet, or more specifically, a kibble diet, that's introducing too many bad bacteria and causing immune system imbalance that leads to the ill health problems mentioned. I wrote a comprehensive ebook for pet parents feeding a kibble diet so they can manage a simple step-by-step -step process and boost their dog's kibble meals quickly and conveniently so the dog's gut health improves quickly and day-to-day -day health issues decline. 
You'll find a link below in the description and a link above explaining more about the healthier kibble diet. Don't leave your dog's gut health to chance. Build up your dog's healthy gut flora levels with the five steps to balance your dog's immune system and you'll help your dog to better health and add years to their life. It doesn't involve a lot of work or cost. It just requires a little knowledge and the desire to give your dog the healthy body they deserve. And if you found this video useful, please remember to like it, share it with friends and subscribe so you'll always be up to date on all the latest videos that I do. And until next time, see you then. Bye bye.